Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the Anderson L3 pressure and level sensor. I am a key account and sales manager with Anderson and I've been with the company for over 22 years. In that time, I've served as a service type support role as well as commissioning and startup type support and working with applications with pressure. One of the challenges is often what is the right device for the job? Can I take a small compact type simple application sensor and go and put it in that hydrostatic level application? Or if I go to the opposite side of that spectrum and start with a full high end level sensor, can I go and service all of my pressure applications? And so we really took that problem with the L3 and stepped back with the design and, and looked to put all of those features into one device. And so that began with looking at the performance type characteristics needed for level application. And as a result, we came up with an industry leading one tenth percent calibration spec on this device. Part of the benefit with coming up with a tight accuracy tolerance is tremendous turndown of 10 to 1 rating on this device. So I can take as an example a 500 pound pressure transmitter type device and use it in 0 to 50 PSI maintaining the stated accuracy on the device. So tremendous range for one single product. Then separately looking at the mechanical de design of the device, we went after really what is needed for washdown environment and part of that result is IP69K rating on a device that's effectively serviceable. To maintain that IP69, it's a it's a patented dual O-ring type of uh, fitment to all the service points, the cap, the connector, and the stem on this device. And with that, you end up with a device that is effectively serviceable. I can have a sensor like this in the top of a horizontal pipe with the display facing me in that line, and I can take and with simple tools, break this device apart and go ahead and put it in a different application. Let's say we switch it from a line pressure device to a hydrostatic tri-clamp level putting it into the side of a tank and with a few simple tools. Now I'm orientated to go into the side of that tank. So what value does that mean to you as a customer? It effectively gives you more recess resources potentially on the shelf. Do I need to have 10 different transmitters on the shelf to support my applications or can I take this one transmitter and use it in all applications within my facility? It also gives you the opportunity to only store fittings. So here's my hydrostatic level fitting that can be basically serviced with the sensor, um, less parts on the shelf, uh, more opportunity to, to keep the plant up and running. So it's a great product. One little fun feature with this product that I think was a happy accident learned after the fact for anyone with a, let's say a flat bottom tank with the sensor mounted on the bottom, the display on this device flips down. And so I've had the benefit during a commissioning to take this display and flip it down and with the sensor vertical, just simply pull that display over and uh, set it up and program from, from a difficult position under the bottom of a tank. If you'd like to learn more about this product, there'll be a link following uh, this recording showing how to, how to contact your local sales support. And uh, I just encourage you to reach out to Anderson Give this product a try. It's a tremendous performance, small, compact device that you can use in most applications. Thank you.